Guys, welcome back here to the Masters as we got another gold medal match. Leia Jansen taking on Anna Lee Waters. And this has seemed to be a common thing that we're seeing here on tour, Braxton. Um, but, you know, we'll get right back to this action here after we have this break brought to you by Jigsaw Health. And welcome back, everybody, as we're back in this gold medal match. Women's singles at the Masters. We got the all-white attire and we're ready to go. Leia Jansen with a quick 3-0 lead here in game one. We are live here at the beautiful La Quinta Resort. It is Championship Sunday. Dave Weinbach with you live here after an epic mixed pro singles match that went on forever. It is ladies singles final time. Leah Jansen, Anna Lee Waters, a matchup that we've seen several times this year in the finals. And that does catch the line for a terrific forehand cross court winner. This will be a best three out of five games here on Championship Sunday. That's a really good return by Anna Lee. That ball really stayed down. Oh, uh, that's a really good backhand cross-court pass. That's Annalie's favorite shot with that two-handed backhand is she loves to let that left hand take over and guide that paddle cross-court. She gets a lot of pace on it and is extremely consistent. And that's going to just sail wide. So we are at 2-7 here in game one. And this is after that missed freebie return. Leia says time out and we will take our own time out. Brought to you by Jigsaw Health. We are back live with you here from the PPA Masters at the beautiful La Quinta Resort and Spa. Just an incredible venue here. Maybe my all time favorite here along the Professional Pickleball Association's tour. Folks, if you want to play where the pros play, check out www.ppatour.com. Our whole schedule is up for 2022. And so excited to bring you this live action here on Championship Sunday, here at the Masters. Oh, what a great return by Anna Lee. It set up that whole point for her. I've talked a lot about the importance of the return of serve in singles. It's the, my, in my opinion, the most important shot in singles. And that's usually who comes away on top is singles. Are the players with the best returns of serves combine that with putting pressure on the serve. That's why you see all the best singles players in pickleball usually come from a tennis background because the skill set is so similar. It's all about the serve, the return, the ground strokes with the passing shots, and the volleys. Three, seven. So Anna Lee trying to creep back into game one here at 3-7. 
and that's going to just sail wide here. So Leia Jensen gets the ball back here. Serving at 7-3, trying to get off this seven number. Dave Weinbach, proud to bring you this live action here on Championship Sunday. And that just sails wide. What an incredible <laughs> mixed final we just witnessed with Lindsay and Riley Newman taking games one and two. And then Lucy Kovalova and Matt Wright storming back taking three games in a row to capture the title here at the PPA Masters. And what touch there by Leia Jansen on that, on that backhand. Cross court volley, tremendous stuff there. Here on Championship Sunday, we'll have Dave the Master Benz in the house pretty soon on the mic. Oh, a terrific cross court forehand there by Leia. Leia, of course, lives out in the Northwest, trains a lot with Tyson McGuffin. She's worked so hard on her singles game in the last year. Uh, very impressed with what she's been able to do on her single side. Of course, a very accomplished doubles player as well. Ball was very, very close to the back edge of the line. Um, referee is going to overrule that call, and then Leia is going to challenge it. It looked like from my angle that that ball was a ball out. So Leia is going to challenge that. So while we look at this video replay, we will take our own break and be right back with you. This is Dave Weinbach here at the PPA Masters. As we uh, have this video replay and the officials determine if that ball was in or out, we are back with you live here at the beautiful La Quinta Resort and Spa. Just an incredible venue. Play started on Thursday. It's been an awesome week of play. A lot of the pros commenting about how this is one of their absolute favorite venues of the year. Uh, to come to. What a gorgeous place. Nestled right into the mountains here. Here in the Palm Desert area, we're about two miles away from the Indian Wells Tennis Garden, where we will be in about a month for uh, the Pickleball Nationals. Brought to you by USA Pickleball. Looking forward to that. How the replays work, folks, is if you do have a timeout left in a game, you are allowed to call for a video replay. If the replay shows in your favor, you keep that timeout. If it doesn't show in your favor, you burn that timeout. If you don't have a timeout available, you are not allowed or able to challenge that call. So the video replay uh, confirms the referee overrule that that ball did indeed hit the line. So Anna Lee will get that ball back, serving at 3-8. And another ball that I think lands in the, on the last three-eighths of the line, and Anna Lee correctly calls good. She thought it was going out and never really committed to that shot. Uh, really good depth on that forehand volley by Anna Lee and uh, forces that air from Jensen. Oh, and, and Leia deciding to stay back off that return. And it worked out because Anna Lee gave her a short ball that she could really attack. She had a lot of options on that shot. Anna Lee just didn't get that ball deep in the court enough or angled off enough and gave Leia an easy pass. So Leia in the driver's seat here. 
Oh, and a big come on by Anna Lee Waters after that forehand cross court winner. Three eight here in game one. In this best of five women's singles final. This will be a matchup where the player that wins will have to win three games here on Championship Sunday here at the PPA Masters. Oh, and that backhand just sails wide. These ladies played their bracket on uh, Thursday. They played all the way up to the final. And then we save the final match here for Championship Sunday. Boy, that forehand roll, cross-court forehand on fire here for Leia Early as she has command here in game one. Dave Weinbach, PPA Tour staff, proud to bring you all this live action here all week long here at the La Quinta Resort and Spa. Great return there, deep to the backhand. Made Annalise's shot very difficult. And that volley is going to sail long, and Annalise a little upset with herself there on that unforced air, so she will call a quick time out. And with that, we will take our own time out. Brought to you by Jigsaw Health. Hey, Lucy. I got your new paddle. Congratulations. It's pretty awesome. Would you sign it? Of course, Patrick. You... Wow. Here you go. Thanks, Lucy. Hey! Back with you live from the PPA Masters here at La Quinta. What a gorgeous surroundings here. Uh, I keep looking for the bighorn sheep to walk down these mountains. I hear there are many in the area. This is Dave Weinbach along with the whole PPA tour crew and all the folks in the truck working so hard to make these productions happen. We are in Game one. That's a really good return by Annalie. That ball was in the back third of the court and really stayed down. Tough pass for Leia. Three, so 3-10, Annalie looking to claw back in this first game. Oh, wow, what a stretch. I thought that ball got behind her. And not only does Leia get the ball back off the tape, Skins backwards. So there it is on a really good deep serve. And she takes game one here. She will need to capture two more games to take this title. And the players will take a little hydration break. They'll switch ends. And we will be right back here with you with game two here from the PPA Masters. Welcome back, Pickleball friends. Dave Weinbach bringing you this live action here from the PPA Masters. We are at the La Costa Resort and Spa. In a, just an epic setting here. Every place you are on these grounds, whether you're playing or spectating, has just a gorgeous view of the mountains, the palm trees. Just a perfect morning to play. 78 degrees, almost no wind. And here we are to start game two and Anna Lee goes big on the serve and gets a freebie, a missed return from Leia. So one zero. Make that two zero here in a 
early lead. Annalie looking to come out a little bit more aggressive here. Go, knowing go. she really can't afford to get down two games. Yeah. And there's her favorite shot is that two-handed cross-court backhand. Generates an incredible amount of pace on that ball and extremely consistent. So that gets her to 3-0 here in game two. Make that 4-0 here in game two, and that will elicit a early timeout here by Leia. And she'll get a drink, and as will we, this break brought to you by Jigsaw Health. It's pretty fun to feel good. Dave Weinbach back with you live here. PPA Masters, the final. PPA tournament of this incredible year of professional pickleball. Folks, if you want to play where the pros play, follow the PPA Tour. And Annalie wants that back. That's her favorite pass is that two-handed backhand cross court. So really good time out there by Leia. Serving 0-4, game two. Oh, tremendous athleticism demonstrated by both players there with incredible court coverage. Anna Lee comes away with it, gets the ball back, serving 4-0 here in game two. And just pushes that ball wide. She got the look that she wanted. So let's see if Jansen can put some points together, get back into this game too. And she gets on the board here at 1-4. Going to be another hot one, sports fans. Uh, 91 will be the high this afternoon at about 2 o'clock. And Leia gets a little bit greedy on that serve. It's going to sail a foot long. So 4-1. That's a rare unforced air on that backhand volley. That's one of her favorite shots. That's a really good return there. And that's what she likes. She likes that backhand volley. Very consistent that it usually gets that ball deep in the court, puts a lot of pressure on her opponent. Uh, good pressure there by Annalie getting that ball deep in that forehand corner. Five, forces four. that air. Susie's at five now. Uh, Leia wants that one back. That was an easy forehand volley that she's going to be able to execute nine out of ten times. Seven one, great deep serve by Anna Lee. Oh, what a backhand slice. Cross court by Leia skidding away from Anna Lee Waters, not able to catch up with that. So she's got a chance here to get back in this game, serving at one seven. Oh, and that does not come back enough. So Leah gets to 2-7 two, here. Two, seven. Yeah. Yeah. Leah had a lot of options there. Anna Lee guessed correctly and puts an easy forehand volley winner away. So now she's going to try to get to eight right here on this serve. She went deep to the backhand. 
Oh, and that sets up an easy pass. And Jansen's going to use her second and final timeout of this game as she is down 2-8 after capturing game one. This is the best three out of five matchup here on women's singles gold final match here on Championship Sunday at the PPA Masters. Folks, we'll be right back. We are back live, pickleball friends, here on Championship Sunday at the PPA Masters. Dave Weinbach along with the whole PPA crew. So proud to bring you this live action all day long here on Championship Sunday. A terrific crowd we've had since 8.15 a.m. this morning. Good run down there by Anna Lee, but she's in a real defensive spot here. Leia takes advantage of that with a terrific backhand roll volley deep. And she gets the ball back at 2-8. Right Side out here to Anna Lee. Looking to get to nine and getting closer and closer to taking game two. After losing game one handily, 311. Oh, it's going to sail way wide. Really good backhand volley there by Leia to set that up. So she's going to try to keep building here, serving 2 8, game two. Yeah, we've seen that three or four times early in this match. The Anna Lee cross-court forehand roll for a flat-out winner. Great shot. Eight, so let's see if she can get to nine here. Oh, Leia, after a great return, decided to stay back. I wouldn't recommend that because... When you hit a great return in singles that's deep in the corner, you really want to close into the net on the angle that you hit the return. And that closes off the passing shot angle of your opponent. Not sure why she decided to stay back on that prior point. So let's keep an eye on that as this match progresses. She's going to get this. Oh, great hustle. Oh, that's just too good by Anna Lee. We all thought she was going to go cross court on that two handed backhand overhead, as did Leia. But at the last second, opens up the face of that paddle and goes deep down the line for a winner to get her to game point. Oh, that's very impressive. That's the fourth time that Leia's come up with the goods on these high backhand volleys where she just knifes it. Cross court slicing away from Anna Lee where Waters cannot catch up to that ball. See if she can get back in this game at 2-10. And that mystery turn is going to help. So that gets her to three. Oh, nice passing shot there by Le Le Leia. Really made Anna Lee move to that ball. And in pickleball, folks, in any sport, 
when you make your opponent have to move to the ball, there's a much greater chance that they're going to make an error. Oh, Leia got a little casual with that volley, but it clips the tape and does just come over for a winner. So Anna Lee's gonna call a timeout. We are gonna stay with you. No, we're gonna take a very quick jigsaw health hydration break. We'll be right back. Singles gold. So Waters will get the ball back here, serving at 10-5. Trying to capture game two after falling down a game Ten, five. to Leia Jensen. And Leia deciding to stay back Four, after that return of serve. So Anna Lee takes game two at 11-5. So they have split games at 1-1. Remember, in this championship Sunday format, it is the best three out of five games. So the player to win this gold medal, they will have to win three games, not the traditional two out of three games. Here on Championship Sunday at the PPA Masters. Brought to you by Hyundai. Dave Weinbach back with you live here from the PPA Masters. Brought to you by Hyundai. We are at the beautiful La Costa Resort and Spa. I'm at La Quinta. La Costa is out in the San Diego area. We are in La Quinta. And just an epic atmosphere here. Start a game three here. Jansen serving to Waters. Oh, what a terrific run down there by Leia after a deep backhand volley into the Jansen. Forehand corner, terrific court coverage Four, there. Zero. These two players in incredible physical shape. They've had a couple of different three game battles this year. It wasn't long ago that we were in San Clemente, California, uh, where these two had an epic zero, zero. five gamer where Leia came back after losing the first two games to take that title just about 100 miles from here. And that backhand winner volley all created by a tremendous forehand cross court deep return, putting a lot of pressure on Leia's pass. Zero two. Zero two here as we start game three. And boy, as we talked about in the preview, Anna Lee Waters, two-handed backhand cross-court is, in my opinion, the best two-handed passing shot in the women's game. One, and I don't think there's a close second. And that's going to creep over. She's going to go around the post. Oh! I thought Anna Lee would go around the post. And so did Leia Jansen. She was running hard left to cover it. And Anna Lee at the last second turns the face of the paddle over and goes cross court for the winner. Incredible shot. And that's gonna just sail wide by a ball and a half. And that gets Leia the ball back here as we move on in game three. 2-2. Two, two. We are all tied up here in this women's gold final. Yeah! And Leia just didn't do anything with that, that forehand pass and a little bit upset with herself there. She knew that she had a great opportunity there on that pass and just didn't commit two, two. to that shot. I think Leia has to switch up this return a little bit. She's taken a lot of balls deep to Annalie's backhand, but Annalie's so dangerous on that backhand pass. I think one of the shots that's underutilized 
in singles is the deep return down the middle. The reason I like that shot, like that one, is that it doesn't give the server, it doesn't give the server a great angle to pass when you get that return deep down the middle. So I think Leia heard me because she just took those two last returns down the middle. Oh, and she had, the ATP was there on a backhand. It just sails wide. A great effort there by Leia Jansen. And it would have been a winner if she could have gotten it in. But it just sails wide. And with that, she calls a timeout here in game three. So she's gonna get a little bit of some hydration on the sidelines, try to find some shade. And we will take our own break, brought to you by Jigsaw Health. It's pretty fun to feel good. Dave Weinbach, back with you live here at the PPA Masters at beautiful La Quinta Resort and Spa. A great deep serve by Annalie Waters. Not only did she get it deep, there was a lot of pace and a lot of topspin on that ball that made that return real difficult. So Waters takes a six to lead here in game three. Oh, Leia set it up perfectly. She got the ball she wanted. She's gonna make that backhand cross court volley nine out of 10 times. Seven, two. So it gets Annalie to seven, two here in game three. And that just sails wide, correctly called. So Leia gets the ball back in her hand here. Gonna try to make her own run here and get back in this game three. And that's a really good start to doing it. So Anna Lee checking out that ball. It did take a weird bounce on that serve, but I think it just took a strange bounce on this court. The ball is fine and we are moving onward here. 3-7 in game three here on Championship Sunday. A really great passing shot there. And as we move on here in game three, it will be 4-7. We have a Waters timeout. And Anna Lee asking the ref to check the ball after two strange bounces in a row. So with this hydration break brought to you by Jigsaw Health, we'll be right back with you. Along with the whole PPA tech staff and all the folks back in the truck. Proud to bring you this live action here all day long on Championship Sunday here at the PPA Masters. 4-7 here in game three. Another ball that really stayed down. A lot of spin on that ball from Anna Lee off that backhand top spin cross court. And we're seeing, seeing Leia with that deep return down the middle. So I think that's a return that can be really effective. I think that's an underutilized shot Four, seven. in singles. I think that should be utilized more to not give your opponent a great angle on that on that passing shot. And speaking of creating angles, great down the line angle by Anna Lee on that two-handed backhand volley. So Waters trying to get off of the seven. And that is one way to do it. Great setup shot deep. To lay his backhand. So Waters up. Eight four. Eight four. Game three. Oh, what a return! Uh, that volley did sail long, but it wouldn't have mattered because Jansen's left foot correctly called. 
was on the kitchen line. So Leia will take another time out here and we will take our own break. Brought to you by Jigsaw Health. It's fun to feel good. Dave Weinbach back with you live here at the PPA Masters on Championship Sunday. Another gorgeous day here in the desert. We are about a mile and a half away from the Indian Wells Tennis Garden. The host of Nationals will be back in about four weeks right here in the desert here. Time is back in here. Game three, nine, four. Waters trying to get to 10 here. And interestingly, Leia staying back after that return, changing things up a little bit. And Anna Lee with an unforced error. Four, nine. Four, nine. And Waters getting a little bit greedy on that return. Gives Leia a freebie point. Five, nine. Gets her to 5-9. Game three. After splitting the first two games here in this gold medal match. And that backhand slice return is going to sail long. And that gets Waters to game point here in game three. 10-5. Ten, 10-5. Five. Ten, five. Right That's going to sail long and wide. Waters got the look that she wanted with that backhand. So let's see if Leia can claw back into this game slowly here five, ten. at 5-10. Oh, that is dirty. What a beautiful cross-court backhand winner to get to six. Players telling me that on the court, it feels about 96 degrees. We are in the nice shade here in our broadcast booth. Oh, wow. I thought Anna Lee's return skidded on the line to make Leia's passing shot really tough. But Annalie didn't come in, so it didn't put any pressure on Leia's passing shot. I really felt when Annalie hit that return, I think she thought in her own mind that she missed it long. And that's why she didn't come in. And Leia hits a winner off it. So Annalie with another timeout. We will take our own break. Brought to you by Jigsaw Health. Dave Weinbach back with you live here on Championship Sunday at the PPA Masters. We are in beautiful La Quinta Resort Seven, and ten. Spa. Just an epic setting for pickleball. Talking to a lot of the pros, this is their favorite venue of the year so far here along the PPA Tour. And a huge come on by Anna Lee Waters knowing what a key point this is in this very important game three. This gives her a game Seven, point Seven. At 10 7. And a backhand volley, an easy backhand volley, sails way long. And that's the ball she wants. That's her strength, is that backhand punch volley with her tennis background. Leia is usually a terrific volley or the ball, both on her forehand and her backhand. So Anna Lee Waters will take a Two games to one lead here in this best of five game matchup. It is getting hot out there. The players really are going to seek some shade here, some hydration. They're going to get a, a three minute break here before we start game four. Leia Jansen going down two games to one. She will have to win the next two games to take this title. Anna Lee Waters with a two game to one lead is one game away from taking this women's pro gold here on Championship Sunday from La Quinta. We'll be right back, folks. Dave Weinbach, 
Thanks for joining us, Pickleball friends. Stay with us. Welcome back, Pickleball friends. We are back. Start of game four. Water's up two games to one. And that return sails long, so let's see if Waters can get some early momentum going here, which could be a deciding game four here on Championship Sunday. Waters coming out on fire here with two quick points. Leia must win this game to force a deciding game five. We had a five game match earlier today. Our first match of the day on Championship Sunday was the mixed pro final. The Wichita tandem of Lucy Kovalova and Matt Wright coming back from two games down to defeat the Newman brother-sister tandem of Lindsay and Riley in dramatic fashion. And after a 4-0 quick lead here in game four, Leia will call a quick timeout here. Let's see if she decides to change anything up. And we'll take our own break, brought to you by Jigsaw Health. We are back live, and as we come back, Anna Lee with a clear ace off that forehand topspin Deep serve, took a little bit of an awkward bounce. Looks like Leia took her eye off of it and whiffed at that serve. So that gets her to 5-0 here in this game four. Make that 6-0. So Anna Lee with a commanding lead here in this game four, which could be the final game if she captures it of this women's singles gold medal and another unforced air there by Leia. Looks like she's getting a little bit mentally down on herself and definitely affecting her play. Oh, and a very unlucky net court winner. Uh, and Anna Lee with a 8-0 early commanding lead here in the women's gold final. Championship Sunday, PPA Masters, La Quinta Resort and Spa. Dave Weinbach will be right back with you. Dave Weinbach back with you live here. PPA Masters. Anna Lee taking total control of game four in rapid fashion. But Leia says not yet. See if she can make her own run here and try to force a game five, zero eight. Oh, that's just a great return there by Waters. Not only did that ball have a lot of pace, it stayed down and got deep in the court. And Leia just looking a little bit mentally frazzled here with how this game four is going. Nine zero. And Annalie Waters in total control of her game from the start here in this what looks like a deciding game for 10-0. She's one point away from the title. So Leia's going to get the ball back here, serving at 0-10. And that return does sail long, correctly called long. So Leia serving at 110, trying to slowly claw her way back. Oh, wow, what a return to clip the line. Oh, great court coverage. Folks, after this match on Champions Sunday, we will have the men's pro final. 
where Matt Wright will take the court again with Ben Johns taking on Riley Newman and Tyson McGuffin, a matchup we've seen time and time again on Championship Sunday here at the PPA. Called out, Leia appeals it, and the referee overrules the call. To me, it looked like it hit the line, so a correct overrule. So Leia, Leia still has a chance here at 110. Game four. Match point. Great return there by Leia, getting that ball deep in the court and then closing to the kitchen quickly, not giving Waters much of an angle to pass. That's so important in singles, Four, folks, is ten. close to the line quickly, and that cuts off your opponent's passing shot angle. Oh, so close. Missed by half a ball wide and a great eye by Annalise. So here's another match point for Waters. Oh, and she wins it off a lit court in a matchup we've seen many times here on Championship Sunday. Leia Jansen, Annalee Waters with another incredibly competitive match. Annalee takes another title. 14-year-old Annalee Waters from the Boca Raton, Florida area. A national champion with her mom in doubles. A mile and a half away is now the champion in La Quinta at the PPA Masters. And she gets a nice championship picture with that trophy and the commissioner of the PPA, Connor Pardo and Connor and his whole team have just done a masterful job all year long here at the PPA, going to spectacular venues all over the country. This might be my personal favorite, the La Quinta Resort and Spa. Anna Lee Waters, just fantastic from the start here in this women's gold final. Don't go anywhere, sports fans. We have the men's gold final coming up next with Tyson McGuffin along with his partner, Riley Newman. We'll take on Ben Johns, the number one player in the world, teaming up with Matt Wright, hailing out of Wichita, Kansas, in a matchup we've seen time and time again. I expect that to be a very competitive match. Terrific crowds all week long here at the PPA Masters in La Quinta, at the La Quinta Resort and Spa. It's our pleasure to welcome you back to the PPA Masters on these bright green courts. I have our champion, Annalie Waters, here to speak with us after her match. What a match that was. You played phenomenal throughout. There's a bit of a rivalry that's cropped up between you and Leia. How do you combat that? Do you like that rivalry that you've got? Well, I've been playing Leia pretty much all year. I actually played her in, I think, 2019 in one of my first singles tournaments ever. So it's been going on for a couple of years now, but recently it's been a lot of finals that I've been playing with Leia, and I actually really enjoy it because there's a little competition between us, and I know it's always going to be a really good match when we step on the court. Is this the way you wanted to finish your 2021 career? I mean, it's amazing to finish 2021 winning the last PPA Masters, and I can't wait for next year. All right, let's talk about 2022 while I've got you here. What are your goals for next year? I want to get a triple crown. That's something that I haven't yet received, but next year I think maybe there's one in my future. Oh, I like it. I'm pretty sure you're right. <laughs> Hope to see that next year out of you, Annalie. Big congratulations once again. All right, guys, back over to you.